Hi guys, my name is Did and welcome to my channel. Uh, for those who are new, please subscribe to my channel and follow me on social media. Then we can DM together on makeup, makeup. And please, can you use this hashtag? French Dutch fam uh, because of my accent for those who follow me they maybe know why I want to make this family growing up then I can know that my accent doesn't disturb you doesn't disturb you because uh, don't speak very well English and blah 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 today's video as you've uh, watch it on the title is a drugstore full face of drugstore uh, makeup I'm so excited about it so jump to the video <laughs> I can't talk about affordable makeup or drugstore makeup without first showing this baby boy here. This is the Bright, the name of the palette is Bright by uh, Beauty Bay. First time playing with Beauty Bay makeup um, and this palette, I choose this palette, I will show you why because of the color inside of course, talks to me more. They have a bunch, like they have a big palette, small ones. I, I'm not in the mood of big palettes, guys. Like I'm not a, a makeup artist or makeup. Uh, yeah, I'm not a makeup artist, so I don't use those palettes. So for me, it will be like just wasting my money, you know, and I don't have enough places here. Like even if I love makeup. And this is, um, there is nine color, nine color and uh, it's cruelty free and vegan look at the packaging how cute it is this holographic kind of holographic honestly it's you have this sweet uh how can i say yeah like uh, diamond and lips this sweet images inside the packaging and here is the palette guys and she's beautiful palette like really really beautiful the packaging is so soft and you even feel this you know like look at this and you feel it it's really really cute packaging guys i want to be honest with you it doesn't sound cheap or something behind you have the instructions of the palette i mean of the shades and yeah i'm so happy look at this i will open it with you guys here are the shades like you have really cool tone and warm tone that's why i picked this palette but believe me you have really really uh big options take this baby boy here you have a mirror here and really handy like really handy you have shimmery one two three four four uh one two yeah four shimmery uh shadows and matte ones and you have the name in front and this is really awesome like really really helpful so excited i don't know which kind of eye look i'm come with i will do but let's just play with it guys here guys for me it's not easy to be honest with you to play with drugstore makeup why 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 believe me i will i wish i can but like in Switzerland guys, first there is like four or five uh, brands of makeup, of drugstore makeup, there isn't more. And uh, there is not, all the time there is not new lunch, so it's always the same. First and first, primer. This is by Maybelline Face Studio Prime, Pore Minimizing Primer. So primer let's try this baby boy here lately i got so many breakout guys i don't know why i really crossed my fingers it was it wasn't one of uh, the foundation i've tried lately because everything i've tried till now i love it like it works really good with me okay let me open this the packaging is really awesome too like oh this is cute here it is Focus. Okay, hope you can see because honestly, 
Oh, it sounds thick. And it's there is a smell. It remembers me, to be honest with you, the professional by benefit. Yeah, it's really thick. Okay, and actually I feel that I've picked too much, but no matter. Because my pores are not the best lately. Okay, it's really smooth. It's thick. There is a smell but really soft one, like not it doesn't disturb that much. Nice. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Oh my god, it really. To be honest with you, it really fills my pores, guys. Oh my god. <laughs> to let the primer set a little bit, I'm so excited. You can imagine how much I'm excited, guys. Uh, yeah, jump to the eyes, the palette, oh, which I look, I can come with this beautiful, beautiful shadows. But I feel that there isn't a tra transition shade in this palette, guys. Hmm. Maybe I have to go with the bronzer. Anyway, I will do my best. I will go with Heat Wave, it's the orange shade here. It sounds pigmented. Yeah, it is. It's pigmented. It's not powdery. I will try to pack it. Look at how pigmented it is, guys. To pack it like this. Like this, then I will grab a fluffier brush. I will go with this color here just to blend everything. It's tutti frutti. It's really pigmented, guys. It's pigmented, it's really good. Come back to the heat wave because I don't want to. I don't want to lose this orange color since I blend it with um, this color here, the tutti frutti. I'm sorry, but my back lately is really hurting me. Actually, it blends so easily, like I'm so excited by this palette because it really blends easily, the color is so pigmented. I didn't make swatches, but I love this color. This color is guys really great. Right now I want to darken like more this out corner and I will use cereal strawberry. This one here. My God. Do you see how pigmented it is guys? I'm impressed. First I pack like that. <sighs> and not. Then 
back to this. Just to blend everything together. So here it is. Now I will cut the crease. Then I will grab this color lemonade, lemonade color here. here to use it on to use it on my eyelid. Let me see with my finger. Oh, it's really creamy, guys. Why there is no focus? Here it is, maybe. Come on. Hmm. Oh my god. Like really, I love it. It's really easy. So easy to play with, guys. I will use this pointed uh, eyeliner, fine liner. This is by Zoeva, and I will uh, wet it. play with this shade here sorry this shade this shade here the pink shade here in the palette shimmery one this is candid candy floss candid candy floss you see This candid, this one here. Hey, this one here. It's really creamy. It's this this color is really soft, but I feel like I can use it to make like a transition between yellow. Sorry, it's my music. Yellow and. Um, Red or orange, or not. don't know how to say it. I really love this color. I imagine to use this color by itself on all my lids. I will do another tutorial on this palette because I really want to play with those colors here, guys. Okay, here it is some eyeliner. I feel with this kind of makeup eye look, I mean. If you have like fake <laughs> false lashes, whoa, it will be awesome. But I don't like false lashes, guys, I'm sorry. So, here it is. I will just use an eyeliner. Yes, I have one by NYX and my favorite. This is the black. Really, really good one, guys. I really recommend it. I've already played with this. I really like it because it's so fine. Look at this applicator. Let's do it. And it's really black, guys. Here it is. So happy. So, 
jump to mascara I have first to curl my lashes this um for those who follow me you already know that i love essence mascara this one never leave my vanity because i'm in love with this one but they come with a new one for spring this is the volume stylist care and hold mascara good vibes good memories by essence this baby boy here the packaging is really really cute by the way and I want to try it here it is so next complexion my favorite part um, yeah, I've picked this one by Max Factor. This baby boy is a glassy packaging. I really love it. It's really like luxurious. It's a pink mood. I don't know what. This is Maker Glow Pro Eliminator. I want to use it like outside of my face, not on my T zone. I want to try it. There's a pump. I really like uh, glow. Okay, here it is. Yes, there is a smell that really sweet one. I really like a glow, you know, things on spring. And on spring, and I feel that those glow cream. Oh yeah, look at this guys, really cute, love it. I like it because I like to mix it, you know, with foundations. And when it's not pricey guys, they deserve it, <laughs> when it works. As I said, I try it on the, fl on the store and yeah, I have a big pimple here. It's not maybe the best way. This option, but honestly, I really like this one, guys. For foundation, foundation, guys, it's not new, okay? But I'm always scary about stick foundations, and but it's so easy in the same time to do it to quickly when you are in the rush. I grab this one, and to be honest with you, I I wanted just to try a contour. Uh, stick foundation but they said multifunctional multifunction makeup stick it means that you can use it for uh, concealer oh, no sorry for contouring and foundation as a foundation too I've grabbed this shade here to contour and when I try it on my skin on my hand it becomes powdery and I was like really this is awesome I have to try it but I'm a little bit afraid about the shade, guys, like because there isn't, they don't, they don't come with all of shades here in Sweden. They, this is the makeup artist who tell me this, and I was like, really? This, she said, yeah. Okay, so it said that it's a creamy matte formula and precision blender formula matte. Okay, that is blender and precision blender. Sorry, because there is a blender here, a sponge. And the stick here. I'm in the shade. Uh, yes, True Ivory 003. Okay, True Ivory 003. Here it is. Okay, I don't know how to do it. Just let's just just do it. Okay. Actually, um, maybe it matches. Okay. We start with this side. I don't know if I will use a sponge. Uh, I will use a sponge, but not the sponge of 
applicator but this sponge because I'm in love with this one Okay, the shade is perfect. It's not too well, light. It's not. It's a really perfect shade. I'm happy. I try to build it, but I will try with. Um, I want to try with. A brush just to see if I have more coverage maybe yeah definitely yes you have more coverage and it goes quickly with the, the brush oh my god I love it I really love it guys this is really warm tone guys Let's see. My favorite brush. Blends really easily, like really. It really blends easily, guys. Look at this. I'm really impressed. Because it blends easily. And the shade is warm, but it's okay. I feel that it's like to bron more for bronzer than contouring but Concealer. This is by Gosh. Do you know Gosh brand? Honestly, I, I try to pick more. How can I say? Um, brands that no one talk about, you know? Because I love that. I love discovering and find out new brands. So this is Concealer High Coverage by Gosh. I'm in the shade Ivory 002. Hope it will really conceal. Oh no, no, Dida doesn't work like that. Here it is. Look at the applicator is giant guy. It's a huge one. It's like the elf tart, I don't know, it's like I think it's bigger, honestly. Okay, first time using this concealer guys. Let's see. Look at the coverage. Really? Oh my god, it remembers me the Infiable one by L'Oreal. Sorry. Oh my god, I love it. I love this coverage, guys. Look at this. It's creamy. 
really creamy so for those who has sorry for those who have dry under eye I think you will love this one I love it oh my god this is awesome gosh it's gosh ivory o02 let's see if i can build it it's so creamy I'm in love with this sponge, it's so soft, oh yeah. So, so excited. Okay, let's powder. <laughs> all this and I'm so excited because I don't know this brand I mean gosh uh, Maybelline Essence I don't know I I really already know those brands and but this one it's really a new one this is a natural mineral powder by Benecos natural beauty Benecos do you know this brand and this is a mineral powder, translucent one. They, they have other shades, to be honest with you. But I picked the translucent one because, guys, it comes like with a sweet puff. You see this puff? Powder sometimes is not my best friend. Since I have a dry skin. There is no smell. Okay. Okay, first it doesn't darken my under eye, and this is I like. <laughs> And there is no smell. It's really soft. This is good too. Wow, actually it, it did the job, like, it's a really good one. Okay, contouring, to be honest with you, I've grabbed two, uh, one bronzer and contouring by Maybelline. This is uh, for bronzer because I've really loved the shades, like cool tone. And this is, I think, their new one. This is bronzer and contouring powder. I will see. I will see. Uh, maybe I will start with this baby boy here. And I will grab like a small brush. It's not powdery. It's pigmented. Yeah. It smells something, but I don't know what. <laughs> 
it's warm tone Okay, actually I like it. It's not patchy, it blends easily. And I feel I will go with this one just to see if it's less warm tone. No. Oh, this one smells so good. There is a big fragrance. Let, let's just see. Like, I feel that I feel I will change the brush because I, I really want to see if this one has like. I feel that this one has more cool tone. You know. it and it's more more sorry, more cool tone than the other one and but both blend so easily essence the new release the new launch duo hi duo highlighter good memories once again it comes with um, the mascara one, you know, this one. This is for spring. This is a duo because you have, uh, yeah, I, I was like you, they say duo and I see which duo. <laughs> but like you have the flower here, which is more um, like the shade is stronger than the, the is, yeah, it's stronger than the here, the contouring. That's why maybe they said duo. Let's try it and let's see the bag, okay? I will use my fave brush. Mm, okay. Uh, don't see how oh, it makes both because honestly, it doesn't seem so. Oh yeah, okay. It's really subtle. I like it. And don't forget, by the way, that I've used this baby boy here. Um, yeah, it's really subtle uh, highlighter, guys. It's not so pigmented. Actually, it doesn't bother me because honestly, there is a pinky undertone. I feel that this can be like a blush more than highlighter. That's why I will use it as a blush. Oh yeah, it's powdery. Oh, it's a really sweet blush. So new, it's like a nude blush with a little bit of sheen on it. So that's why I don't answer when I say highlighter. Maybe for those who don't like to be blinding or they love like to do satin one, but honestly, a subtle one, like it's subtle highlighter, you know, for everyday look maybe, but it's powdery. I don't know if you see it, it's powdery, okay? I, it doesn't bother me, but for those who... Honestly, it's 
honestly, it's it's really a go cool one because there is more, not too much. Yeah, I like it. I can use it as a blush and highlighter at the same time. Back to this palette. So, um, yes, I will just use what it stay here on the brush to connect. I really love this satin spray, like look, I've already purchased a new one because this one is barely like it's done and yeah, I really like it guys. So here it is, I try to do something like more extra, more dramatic, just to play, this is the satin spray guys, believe me, it's so like it's it's really it's really dewy like really this one and it's not expensive honestly highly recommended this is the look i come with i really really like it i really i'm a little bit proud of myself i can say this because the blending is incredible so easy because I'm beginner guys and it helps it helps so pigmented the foundation bomb <laughs> easy to use easy to blend even the contouring I mean the shade this eliminator guys mm, I will play with it on my shoulders on my balls I, I already know that I really love it the mascara I'm not so sure to be honest with you the primer by Maybelline The primer by Maybelline, I really, really love it. The concealer, God, love it too. So yeah, uh, in general, this first impression, drugstore first impression is a real success for me. So guys, please, if you like those kinds of video, let me comment down below, subscribe to my channel, follow me on social media, give this video a thumbs up, hashtag French Touch Fam. Please subscribe and yeah, enjoy, peace, love and thank you so much.